Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. I have this one, I was going to be a little more elaborate with this one, but I've spent so much money trying to put together a baseball collection similar to this. So this is my football 1980 to 1991. One pack from each year. You have uh, the 80s, you know, you have Montana rookie in, I think 81? 80, I think 81. And then 86, you're going to have um, Jerry Rice, 84 Marino, Elway. So these are some pretty good packs. I'm going to start with a crappy one first. So we're going to go get moving on this. I think the, I don't know, best card, but rookie-wise, the best rookie might be Tony Saragusa. So we're going to be on the prowl for that. And then, of course, a couple big names. There's Emmett Smith, Marino, and Elway, and all those guys. So let's get cooking here. You have a Jerry Rice, 1,000 receiving yards. Put that in the background. You can't see it unless I do this. And it, perhaps will that work? Yeah, it focuses out, but whatever. We'll, we'll get there. Here we go. Neil Anders. Keep DeLong. So this is 91. This is the back of 91, in case you're curious. There you go. This is a ah, touchdown, Timmy Brown. I think he's all, yeah, he's a Hall of Famer. He's got to be a Hall of Famer. Uh, Warren Moon played forever into his 40s. Alana Young, Max Montoya played a good guard for the Raiders back in the day. Bob Golick, another Raider, very nice. Brian Hinkle, Stan Brock, Vince Clark, rookie. This is a draft pick card there, and that's the back is the same. I was thinking maybe they'll you know change it up a bit. They didn't. Another Warren Moon, very nice. Uh, Anthony Miller, very good receiver for the Chargers in the 90s. This is, uh, I guess, fourth year card, Neil Anderson. Anything. Okay, so that was 91. There you go. I guess, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Packs, um, nobody, nobody really cares. We'll put them up there. Okay, 1990. Um, rookie cards, I think, like a Daryl Johnston... Rookie card, if I'm not mistaken, I don't remember if the 1990 had like top super rookie written on them, even though technically their rookie year was year prior, for like Deion Sanders, Troy Aikman and whatnot. There's a gum looking pretty crisp. Let's see if we can get that in focus. That doesn't look too bad. All right. Actually, I'm going to throw that in the garbage, but I'll put the packages up there. So... Oh, nice start with a 1,000-yard club. Barry Sanders, my favorite of all time. Ronnie Lott, very good safety. Hey, Terry McDaniel, good quarter, corner on the Raiders. Steve Atwater, super rookie. Again, I don't think that's technically his rookie card. It might be a pro set or 89 traded or something. Maybe. Just shooting from the hip here. <laughs> I don't really know. Um, there's Mark Jackson, Guy McIntyre. A hasty return. So this is James Hasty. I don't know if his son is the the Justin Hasty or whatever or relative. Maybe. I mean, it, I don't know how common that last name is, but you know, in the football world, Howie Long. You guys probably seen him on Fox, but he was a heck of a defensive end for the Raiders. There's the backs of these cards. Sorry, I forgot to show you earlier. Yeah, he was he was great. Broderick Thomas was good in his day as well. Um, Bratton. Not familiar with Bratton. Sorry about that. Uh, Reggie Langhorn and Terry Taylor. Nothing doing. The thousand yard club is coming through strong for us. All right, so now we're going to get into, let's see. Um, I think this is going to be 89 tops. I'm trying to look to see who would be the rookies. Not from the traded, because I think the traded is where you want to be. But. With the regular set, you're going to get um, Tim Brown, Michael Irvin, Sterling Sharp, who, if you, those of you didn't get to see Sterling Sharp, he was a very good receiver. His brother, Shannon Sharp, everybody kind of knows him, um, who also was a great tight end, but Sterling Sharp was good. I think he lasted maybe four years. I think he had an eye injury or something. Or something has. Some injury derailed his career. It's a nice pack. Let's see, John Taylor, Thurman Thomas, Icky Woods, uh, 
He had the Icky Shuffle back in the day. There's Roy Green. Keith Jackson. Very nice. Good tight end. Clarence Verdon. And Verdeen. Pat Leahy. Dave Durson. He was a pretty good safety for the Chicago Bears. DJ Dozier. He also uh, played both sports. He played baseball and football. Here's the backs of these cards. So there's a DJ. Whoa. <laughs> DJ. Come on, man. Get it together. There we go. It doesn't say, but he did end up playing some pro ball as well as um, as football. He just wasn't as successful as Bo or Brian Jordan or um, Deion Sanders. Hmm, check most. All right. Here's Joe Rig. Howie Long again. Very nice. I hope we get his rookie because it might be one of those packs. That'd be a nice one. Nice pull. Ozzie Newsom. Seth Joyner, Curtis Adams, and Gil Bird. So far, no hits, but now we're getting to some good stuff. I hope. I don't know what Nate 1980 has in store. I know 88 has Bo Jackson and Vinny Testaverde. Um, let's see. Brian Bosworth. He was a you know good college player. Didn't really have a successful NFL career. Went on to do some acting, and I think he does some commercials. He might work for the one of the networks, perhaps, as an announcer or whatever those are guys are called. Ooh, that almost fell. Okay, so ideally, the best card out of here will be Bo Jackson, and that's what we're hoping for. So here we go, 1,000 yard of Ruben Mays. Upside down, come on. <clears throat> Dexter Manley, good defensive end. There's the backs of these cards here. Joe Nash. Steve Largent, very, very good receiver. I was actually having a conversation with somebody back in the day, and they said the only guys that really get remembered as far as value goes are going to be quarterbacks. One of the best receivers to play the game, Steve Largent. You know, 12,000 yards, even in 88. I think he might have gone on to play a year or two more, maybe, or this could have been his last year. But never really, you know, nobody really cares. Jerry Rice, even though he set all the records, the best ever, just like, oh, yeah, it's, it's good to have his rookie. But nobody really, it doesn't seem like a lot of people outside of the Bay Area love him. That's just what I've been told. There's a Joe Montana. Again, quarterbacks get the recognition. I don't know why I'm not in focus. There we go. Bernie Kosar, pretty good quarterback there for the Cleveland Browns. Jackie Ship. Altoon, another very good receiver. Let's check out his stats. 1,100 yards and 86. And almost 1,000 and 87. Pat Leahy again. And Billy Wilburn. So we did not get what we were hoping to get. A little disappointing because I was hoping for, you know, my man Bo Jackson. Let me uh, pull up my little list here for 87 tops. Apologies for the slight delay. Um, so this one, I actually had a box of these when I was a kid. The only football I really owned. And there's some big names in here. Doug Flutie. <laughs> I said big names when I went to Doug Flutie. Randall Cunningham. Um, Charles Haley. You get, of course, Jerry Rice. Uh, second year is a good card to pull. Um, who else? Herschel Walker, technically, is rookie card. Jim Kelly. Um... But we'll get to it. Let's see what we have here. We have Wesley Walker, 1,000-yard club. Doug Martin. Do you think he's any relation to the same Doug Martin? Fairfield, California. So maybe. Maybe his son is that Doug Martin that played running back for Tampa Bay Raiders and maybe a couple other teams. It's Jerry Gray. <laughs> Bob Crabble. There's a Jim Kelly rookie card. There you go. That's a hit right there. So as you see, he played in the USFL, first year with the Bills. Technically, this is his uh, NFL rookie card right there. That's a nice card. Jim Kelly was a good quarterback. You could check out the corners, perhaps. I don't know if I can focus in. Looks pretty sharp. Sorry about the lighting. I just use a... I'm in my living room sometimes. Bring my mat and stupid background. But anyway, that's a, that's a big hit right there. Oh, my God. Don't F up. Okay. So now let's get back to the cards. Uh, get back to my man Reggie Camp. Ronnie Lott. 
Not his rookie, but he was, man, he would hit people. Tim Harris. Kevin Mack, very good running back. Um, okay, not his rookie. Mike Merriweather. Garen Varis. Steve Largent. Very nice. I don't know. Way, Ray Worshing. Uh, Kelvin Bryant. And Art Monk. Very nice. Ah, ruined. Stupid gum or wax. Oh, well. That's nice. Art Monk is that's good. Okay, so now... 86, again, all I want to pull from 86 is going to be Jerry Rice. But to be fair, some other good cards coming out of there. Let me just kind of refer to my little list. Reggie White, rookie. Boomer Esiason. Um, there's a Walter Payton car, all pro card in here that's pretty good. Uh, what else? What else? Steve Young, rookie card. Can't leave him off the list. Oh, I don't want to mess it up. All right, so let's see. It's nice. Open that one pretty nice. Didn't rip it. I like doing that. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Okay, here's a gum. Eddie Brown, okay. So that's nobody that we're worried about ruining their card. Because as you see, it's not coming off clean. Oh my goodness. All right, well... That's on there. That's on there good. So we're just going to show you that one card. There's Eddie Brown. That's what they look like. 86. Um, I can't see anything. Don't, oh, you just saw that one, didn't you? I, I did too. So sorry. Ruin the surprise. We'll just go with him first then. Oh, come on, man. Oh, no. Well, there's Art Monk. Ruined. Ruined Robert Jackson. But... We did pull a Joe Montana 86, not his rookie, but that is a beautiful card right there. That's what you want. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I'm okay with that. There's the back of that Montana card. It's good, you know. And then it's not centered, as you see, left to right. But hey, man, I mean, anytime you can get one of the better quarter, well, best quarterbacks of the league, in an older one, that's that's good. Sammy Winder, James Brooks. There's Joe Nash again. Jimmy Giles, Otis Wilson. All right, here we go. Curtis Greer, Boomer, nice, Boomer rookie card. Oh no 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 no! Oh God, I thought they were stuck together. Oh, that would have been that would have sucked. There's a boomer rookie. Um, centering, eh, all right. It's not perfect. Of course, it's not. Those those are some good cards up there. Uh, Wilson, Steve Foley, and I think that might be it. Oh no, we have a couple more. Mike Haynes, nice all pro card. Lewis Lips. Uh, Bernie Kosar fakes a handoff. Oh, nice. Dan Marino, second, third year card there. Dang, that's a good one. Look at the back of that. It's clean. It's tough to get perfect centering on these bad boys. But if you look in the background, the cards that we have as hits are quarterbacks. Oh my god, I should like sleeve these up now, but whatever. Um, I don't think any of them are going to get tens, but, and Sammy, I think we did this already. Okay. Well, that was a pretty, really good pack. We, we were able to put, oops, three cards up from 86. Pretty nice. Pretty nice cards. Now we're going to jump into 85. I don't, oh, I remember these. Um, I think Warren Moon. Warren Moon rookie card. Um... Mike Munchak, Mark Clayton, the wide receiver. I'm just reading off a list. Um, so I'm just kind of naming the better cards we could pull. Let's see wax damage on this one. Oh, the gum. And we will do this. Here we go. Tony Franklin. Everson Walls. Very nice. I liked Everson Walls. 
Here's the backs of the 85 tops. There you go. Greg Bell. Fred Smurlos? I don't know how to say his name. So sorry, it's Fred. Andre Tippett. Joe Washington. Nice. <laughs> Barney. Chavis? Barney Chavis? Chavis? Tony Collins. Ray Guy. All right. Well, that's not bad. Ray Guy kicked the punter for the Raiders. Jim Hazlitt. Is he the coach? Didn't he go on to coach Saints or something like that? If it's the same guy, I don't know. Uh, record breaker, Charlie Joyner. Cool. Uh, there's my man Pat Leahy again. That's a lot of Pat Leahy's. Another kicker. We got a lot of kickers in this pack. Not thrilled about that. Oh, that's a nice one. Joe Montana. There's a, that's Mike Merriweather there. This is a good card right there. Um, the black borders kind of prevent, um, you know, it, it really messes things up as far as grading goes. It's not too bad, though. Overall, really good shape. You have a little bit of damage down on that corner. Ah, F word. F you gum. Of all damn oh, son of a. Hey, throw me some tips on how to clean that one up. This is a good card. Shit. Oh, well. It's a good card. It was, it was good while it lasted. Tony Franklin, Everson Walls, and that's that. So that was 85. We pulled Joe Montana, but unfortunately, as we just saw, we had the damage. The damage was done. And we're getting to 84, looking for Eric Dickerson, um, Dan Marino, Jackie Slater, um... And, of course, you know, you're going to look for Joe Montana all the time. You're going to look for uh, everybody. Howie Long, rookie year. So, remember, we said we're going to pull it. Let's pull that mother effa. Yeah, try not to say bad words. Sometimes bad words just come. This is really, really stick sticking in there. That one's really sticky. Um, I don't know. I always, I always worry that I'm pulling them. Um, you know, I purchased these packs, and I hope they're not fake. And, you know, the person selling it to you, sometimes they don't know if it's real or fake. So, you know, benefit of the doubt, I guess. I always hope that they're real and not repackaged. All right, there you go. Open that pretty nice. Oh, missed one side. Okay, so Jeff Chadwick took the brunt of the, uh, the wax there. Jeff Chadwick's rookie. So we're going to... Cut it in half. Oh, there's the gum just fell off. Oh, I forgot to put these stupid cards up here. Hold on just a second, guys. There you go. Okay, so this is 84. Let's, uh, let's pull another big one here. Let me focus. Oh, it's upside down. Ah, Eric Digger. So technically... This is a rookie card, technically. I have a bunch of these cards. Not worth as much as his base. This is an instant replay. Rookie year, rookie card, kind of. Kind of. Doesn't pay you the big bucks like the other one. There's a Wesley Walker team leader card. Ken Anderson. Quarterback of the Bengals. Ooh. Bob Baumhauer. AFC Pro Bowl. Hmm. There's a Todd Christensen, very nice. Let's see the back of that bad boy. Very cool. Ben Williams. Oops. Chuck Muncie, good running back. Frank Hawkins. There's Joe Ferguson. Hmm. I'm not familiar with him. Jeff Chadwick. Jeff Bostick. That's pretty cool. Groff. Wilson. Ron Springs. His son, Sean, ended up playing in the NFL. I think he was actually drafted by the Cowboys. Um, I want to say late 90s, early 2000s. There's a Mike Pruitt running back. 
Oh, man. So we didn't get... We did get the Eric Dickerson instant replay, but not his rookie, so... Meh. 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 That's all right, though. Okay. 83 tops. Mike Singletary, rookie. Jim McMahon, rookie. Um, Marcus Allen, rookie. Gary Anderson, the kicker or punter? I forget. So here we go. This is 83. Careful there. I don't know why. I, I don't know. People like to... Oh, look at the miscut on that card. You have wax damage and a miscut. Let me take this gum off. It just kind of fell apart. Oh, these are all facing... Okay, here we go. Alvin Hall. Some nice, clean cards. I like them. Uh, this is a Super Bowl card. Another card. Stan Walters. Tackle for the Eagles. Uh, team leader card of Sherman Smith. Andra Franklin, running back. Otis Anderson, running back. There's a sticker card. So the back, oh, well, there's the back of the sticker card. Um, let me show you the back of the base card. I forgot to do that. Bob Bruning, MLB. Ooh! We're going to show you the back of Lawrence Taylor because that's an awesome card. Look at that. Very nice. Second, third year. That's pretty cool. I like Lawrence Taylor. There you go. Oh, shit. All right, Gerald Riggs. Yeah, that's his rookie. Nice. I don't think it's worth anything, but Gerald Riggs. It's pretty cool. This is Jeff Moore, Ed Newman, and Matt Millen. Is it Tom Malay? Malady? <laughs> Tom Malady. Oh, damn it. Probably pronounce differently. Anyway. Ah, so we didn't get the huge names. We did, you know, we got an LT, which is nice. And you know what? Gerald Riggs, you get the nod for my rookie. Because he was, he was good. Now we're about to get into some unknown territory here for me. A lot of these early players I'm um, not that familiar with. So we're going into, what is this, 82? 82 tops. Um, there's some good cards in here. Um, Rookie-wise, you get a Lawrence Taylor rookie, Anthony Munoz, Chris Collinsworth, uh, Matt Mellon. Uh, those are some of the bigger, bigger court uh, rookies we're looking for there. Ah, you suck. All right. I don't know. I just got to be careful. Okay. Whatever. There. Good enough. Oh, the gum was still in there. There. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Joe Cribs. Franco Harris. An in-action card. There's a Septian. So the back... Uh, this is an in-action card, so the back does look a little different. Um, Septian, Bill Nell, Neil, sorry, and this is the back of the cards. I mean, these cards are clean. They're in really good shape. I'm happy that the corners aren't all scuffed up or anything. In action, R.C. Thielman. Oh, okay. It's a little sticker. All right. Hey, Vince Evans. He played in the NFL for, he was the old man forever. He ended his career with the Raiders. Jesus. Uh, he had a career. A long career. Bob Parsons. Ozzie Newsome. Ah. Tony Hill. Ah. Bruce Harper. Yui Von Shama. Okay. okay. Julius Adams. 
And back to Joe Cribbs. So we completely struck out on that pack. That was a bad one. All right. Now we're getting into Montana's rookie year. Let me let me see. Should I open this one or the 1980? Nobody's going to want to watch 1980. Well, we're going to go in order. We're going to stick with it. We're going to go 81. Obviously, we want Joe Montana. We can also find Jim Hazlitt, his rookie. Um, Kellen Winslow, senior. Rookie card. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Mark Gastonow, Dan Hampton, Dwight Clark. That would be pretty slick. But you know what? Let's get it right. We only want Joe Montana's rookie. That's all we care about. So, here goes nothing. Russ Francis. Dave butts of every joke. Wes Chandler. All right, second year. Lydell Mitchell. Ooh, Kenny S the Snake Stabler. Not his rookie. Okay, I guess I kind of knew that. Rob Tucker, Roland Hooks, Harvey Martin, Mark Miller, Bob Group, maybe, or Grupp. No names I recognize. Chris Barr, Russ Francis. Damn it! What a waste of a bunch of money. All right, well, we tried. We tried. Good. Teamwork, you know, A for effort, all that jazz. <sighs> well, now we're going to open 1980 after the big wit swing and a miss there. 1980 doesn't have a lot. I think Lester the Molester Hayes for the Raiders. Um, yeah. Phil Sims. Okay, Phil Sims would be a good one. Couldn't get Montana, but we did get Jim Kelly. Boomer. And maybe we'll uh, pick up old Philly Sims here. Of course, if we could find a Walter Payton, that would be awesome. Yeah, it's Walter Payton. Sweetness. Oh, different gum. Look at that. Ew. All right. Last pack, guys. And gals. And other. You know. This guy again? Come on. Ray Finkel. Finkel and Ein Einhorn? Finkel and Einhorn? Raymond Claiborne. Uh, Sydney. John Dutton. Richard Bishop. Otis Anderson. Nice card. All right. That might be... All right, well, you know, we tried. We tried, we tried. Okay, so here's all the cards, 1980 on up. Um, let's see if we could get up just a little bit, and then we get the focus. There it is. So those are the hits. You know, we did get Montana. This Montana, unfortunately, has the stain, gum stain or whatever. We got some good cards. Gerald Riggs, rookie, which, you know, I know probably not worth anything, but I like it. Lawrence Taylor, uh, third year. Eric Dickerson, somewhat rookie year. Boomer, rookie. Yeah. Barry Sanders, 1,000 yard. Jerry Rice, 1,000 yard. I mean, those are the best of those years. Of course, a Jim Kelly rookie is a good one. Joe Montana, 85. With a stupid gum stain. Joe Montana, 86. And Dan Marino, 86. So there you go. If I missed any cards, please let me know because I'm boxing these up, putting them in a little uh, box all together, except for the good ones, of course, and then just kind of not looking at them because I don't think there's anything else really of value in there except for these bad boys. But hey, uh, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think and, you know, all that jazz. Thanks. Thanks again. Bye.